My name is Janusz Gowski and I'm an applications engineer at Generant Company. I'm here to talk to you about one of the most common failure modes for a pressure reducing regulator, a phenomenon known as creep. Creep is when outlet pressure slowly climbs to inlet pressure even though the regulator is set lower. Creep occurs because the regulator is unable to make an internal seal. Here we have a GDR series regulator. The inlet pressure is at 300 PSI and the desired regulator set point is 100 PSI. You can tell it's set at 100 PSI because it stays near there at a wide variety of flow rates. But when I close the valve, the outlet pressure begins to rise to inlet pressure. The leak shown here is severe, but this condition could occur over hours or even days if the leak is smaller. The cause of this failure mode is usually debris on the internal valve sealing surface. To fix this problem, I need to vent my system and remove the regulator. To troubleshoot my creep problem, I will first unscrew the bottom plug of my GDR regulator. Use caution, it is slightly spring-loaded. Inside, you will find the valve and valve spring. You should inspect the valve seal as well as the O-ring inside the valve to confirm that they are in good condition. The seat in the body is where the valve seal engages to stop flow through the regulator. You need to inspect for any debris or damage to the valve seat. As you can see here, a piece of Teflon tape got caught across the valve seat. I removed the Teflon tape from the seat. Since the valve sealing surfaces are still in good condition, all I need to do is wipe off all my sealing surfaces with a clean lint-free swab or cloth and reinstall my bottom plug components. Once I tighten the bottom plug, my regulator is ready to be reinstalled in the system. Now that I have my regulator reinstalled and repressurized, I can see that my creep condition is resolved. 